Hey you. A second please. me you were not going to scream do you remember that or do I have to put that thing on you again so you will remember that okay 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 now you're still feeling a little dizzy I wanna show you that I'm a good person I will give you these drops these drops will help you wake up and feel less dizzy. So, if you don't mind, if you don't trust me, just smell it. It smells good. <laughs> yes, it works. I use them all the time. I mean, it's not that I kidnap people all the time, but sometimes I just, you know, have to try the doses of the drugs that I'll give people to, you know, who fall asleep and then this is to wake up so I use it all the time. But again, I don't kidnap people all the time, it's just that I, in case I need to, at least I will know, so I create a different drug formula according to different weights and sizes of people so, you know, I don't intoxicate people and yes I do try them on myself first so I make sure I don't harm anybody I even tried your dose on myself so I know how much of this you're gonna need okay take them This go under your tongue. Okay, very good job. It's not poison, I promise. Yes, I swallow. Good job. You will already start feeling better, right? Okay. So, um, don't, 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 don't scream or I will have to sedate you again. I have the power. You are tied up real tight as you can see. Not tight enough to hurt you, but tight enough not to make you go anywhere. So I recommend you to stay very, very, very still, okay? Would you do that for me, please? Do that for me. I'm not gonna harm you. I will not harm you, I promise. Okay, let me just wipe your sweat a little bit. I have this super soft wipe that I use on myself. So it's super soft, I know, because I only use the best of the best. And I will use it to wipe your sweat. Do you want me to? Okay, good job. Very, very 
gently, ever so gently. I told you I was not gonna hurt you. I would never and could never hurt you. I just need to talk to you because I'm a big fan of you and you never talked to me. You never looked like you wanted to talk to me, so I just needed your attention. I know it sounds weird, I tried to contact you in other ways, through your manager, through your emails, but that just didn't work. That just didn't work. I am forced, I am forced to do this because I really need, I really need you to listen to me. I wish you could know how much I love you and this is why we're here today. As you can see, I'm not a bad person. I know from the interviews I've been reading that you like girls with platinum hair and earrings that were kind of making fancy sounds so I bleached my hair for you I wear my earrings. The fun fact is that I had no ear piercings before reading that interview. And I pierced my ears just for you. To look pretty for you. And I also know you like girls with lipstick. And I'm wearing my lipstick right now just to look cute for you. What do you mean that that was just an interview for a brand that was selling bleach and makeup and accessories? Were you sponsored to say those things? Do you mean that you usually don't like girls with earrings because I can't take them off? I can take my lipstick off for you. I can dye my hair back to normal for you. I can do anything you want for you. Like literally anything you want. I completely changed my look for you. I can go back to who I was. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter who I am, it matters that I love you and I will do anything, anything I could possibly do to have you loving me back. So if you don't like bleached hair and you were just sponsored to say that you like bleached hair, then I will dye my hair, it's no big deal. I pierced my ears, I pierced them myself. I did it myself with a tiny needle. <laughs> with a tiny needle just for you because you said you liked earrings. I didn't know you were selling a brand in that moment. So I pierced my ears and I bought the earrings you were selling. So now you also have a percentage on that. So you should listen to me, right? Since apparently this was done for no reason, <laughs> but okay, okay, I understand that. I mean, you are a very attractive person and you have an influence and it's your job. I mean, you make a living out of that thing, so okay, but 
just listen to me. I am the perfect person for you. I have seen all... Let me just take my phone so I will have references here just uh, for you. Instagram, scrolling through your feed. Yes, all those hearts are from me, so you, you always have plenty of notifications. I also have like 10 different accounts just to like your comments and leave you DMs every day. That didn't work. Nobody replied to the DMs. And if somebody replied, that was something like your personal assistant, I don't know. And that was awkward. I was getting the same copy and pasted re reply all the time saying that I could talk to you in meets and greets and that I'd have been notified whenever they were available but I mean we are not waiting for that I'm not waiting for a meet and greet this is my chance I am your chance you are my chance we belong to each other so as I was saying scrolling through your feed I can see that you're a very sensitive person. You are a very, very, very sensitive person. And so am I. I see that you are very engaged with the planet, saving our planet, saving the earth. And this is something I do too. I bought reusable straws after watching that um, IG story of you using those reusable straws. I bought them too. And I didn't even drink by a straw before. I just used to drink straight from the glass or the can. But since you use reusable straws, I decided to purchase some reusable straws. And while I drink from the straw, I pretend that the straw is your mouth. So we basically make out every time I drink. Isn't that cute? Oh my gosh. Like literally, I'm so sensitive. Just like you are. I was saying, moving on, moving on, moving on. You like fashion. You have a very interesting sense of fashion. You don't like things that are too exaggerated, but also you do like things that are too simple. And this is something I very love. I mean, I, I feel that way too about fashion. I love when things are well made. Yes, 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 yes. Well made. And good quality not to exaggerate but not too simple like look at my t-shirt today it's like a t-shirt but it's not like a plain t-shirt because it's gray it's not white you see we are meant to be together then moving on to your tweets I'm such a huge fan of your tweets it feels like really living with you on a daily basis, being part of your life, like the good morning tweets you send, it's like, um, it really makes my day every day, I feel like you write them for me, I get that you don't understand, you don't understand that you're writing them for me, because you didn't know I existed until now, but now you know I exist, and um, how can I say, uh, we're meant to be together, now you know I exist, you know I am your other half the apple, <laughs> I am meant to be yours, and, um, uh, like, today is a beautiful day, have a look at what you've done so far and be thankful for that get ready for a bright future I mean really I've done so many things that I didn't even notice I did until until reading that tweet from you I mean I've seen other tweets like that all the time but the way you say things is so intense 
it has a vibe I didn't realize I did so much until today and the bright future I was like yes yes it's my chance it's my chance I've been dreaming of spending time with you my entire life basically and I was like really planning planning how that could eventually happen you know and yes I've come so far because I thought of all the details in my mind and I was like bright future means that all these details actually have to be put into something and you know practiced so like yes I will have to do this I'll have to keep kidnap this person you know this amazing person that brought light into my life show how thankful I am and start a future together you and I together why do I feel like you don't agree with what I'm saying I mean it's basically your words that I'm reading and you don't seem like getting it what is wrong other tweet Good night, sweet dreams, my angels. You know, my grandma used to call me my angel when I was a child. And that was a sign. That was a sign that I am your angel. And we are meant to be together. You and I. I am your angel. Your angel brightening your days, lighting up your life basically you know and then this picture i love to start my days with green matcha green matcha oh green matcha green matcha it's so delicious i love to start my days with green matcha too i didn't even know what that was until that day i i i've been through this tweet Sorry, my bones are cracking because I'm super nervous. Um, but yeah, then I, I went um, and bought a, a cream matcha and that really illuminated me. And I was like, oh my gosh, yes, yes, we're meant to be together as one. Also, I know you don't like when you get very sweaty because you don't feel very comfortable um, because in this tweet you were saying if you're struggling with oily skin like I do um, please go buy this blah 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 it's a lifesaver and well I couldn't find it I tried to use your discount code but that didn't really work um, I don't know why but it, I thought if you you don't like being oily I totally get that so I brought some translucent powder here today and I will just apply it on you um, I will just apply it on you and all the oiliness will go away let me show you I can do it on myself you see all the oiliness goes away, so that's what I'll be doing on you as well. Still, you have to hold still, or how can I even do it? Why are you moving far away from me? I mean, you cannot go that far. You can't go far away. You're tied up. Because I used it on myself, you don't want me to use it on yourself? I mean, we'll be sharing the same bed, the same toothbrush holder for the rest of our lives. And you don't want me to use this brush on you. You still didn't get it, right? Listen, 
I know you don't know me yet. I tried to tell you things of myself and that eventually didn't open your eyes a little bit. And that's okay. But let me show you that I can make you feel comfortable. Okay, let me just remove the shine of your face, like, like the way you like, because you don't feel comfortable when looking oily. So I, I, I just bought. Do you know this? How much this costs? It's the priciest on the market, but it's the best performing. I bought it just for you today, to make you feel at ease. Let me just brush your face, please. Let me show you I'm a good person. Come on, still. Doesn't it feel relaxing? I know it feels relaxing. So let me just brush your face. I don't want to hurt you. want to hurt you. I really don't. I want to spend my entire life with you. Every single day of my life with you by my side. Is it asking too much? Your manager never replied to my emails or DMs. When she did, she was like super, super annoyed by me because I, she said I couldn't understand that you had your life going on and you already had a partner. So you know what I did? I started studying your partner on all social media around the streets as well and you guys are not happy together you guys are not happy together let me tell you I know you more than anybody else I do know you more than anybody else in the world whether you like it or not and I'm sure of what I'm talking about. You're not happy with that person. That's not the right person for you. You think it is, but it's not. I am the right person for you. Because I would give up everything for you. I travel so, so far away far away from my home far away from my family just to be with you just to have you here I gave up my job everything because I know that you will fall in love with me just needed a couple minutes with you to prove you that I am the right person for you. I knew it would work. That's why I'm here now. Brushing your face gently. How you like it to be. Your partner would never brush your face like this. Nobody would. I love you. You are the love of my life. I would never let you go. Never. Because I love you. So much. Why 
don't you want to understand that? Why? I give up everything and you don't seem like you are believing me. I mean, you, you, I see the way you look at me. You think I'm stupid. You think I'm crazy. I know this is not the right approach, okay? I usually don't approach people like that on the street. I... Oh gosh, I, of course I don't. Maybe you need to think about it a little more. I will put this back on you. You said no? Why should I not do that? Why should I not put this on you? Because you need some time, you clearly need some time to think about it. What do you mean? You're saying this just because you don't want me to put this thing back on you. I know it's like that. So why did you change your mind? Really? You think I'm cute? Yes, I bleached my hair for you and pierced my ears for you and put on this makeup for you because I love you You don't like my lipstick? Okay, it's okay. I will take it off right now I will take it off for you. I will. I promise I'll you said you didn't like it. I want to show you that I love you. And I will take it off for you. Plus, you want to smell how good this smells. Like this wipes. This makeup wipes are smelling so good. I will take my lipstick off for you. Okay. Uh, look, I'm taking it off. That's just for you because I love you. What do you like to see on my lips? Yes. Yes, it's not a problem for me. I can. This wasn't even the real me, actually. I wanted to sort of impress you and then eventually introduce my real self. I will put some gloss real quick so you're gonna see my lips more naturally. You see the brand you were promoting? I have everything from that brand. Do I look any cuter now? Really? Thank you. <laughs> I knew you were gonna like me. It's not because I like myself, but I knew there was, I knew there was something, something between us that, yes, something that could never, never, ever separate us. Am I not right? I so know. We are twin souls. I did all for you. I knew it was kind of crazy, but I only had this occasion to talk to you and have your attention. And would you ever find somebody else in the world ready for this, my love? Just only for you. Let me fix your shirt here. I'm looking better now. Yes, it's a little bit ripped because I had to struggle a little bit, but I've been studying your routine for several 
month so I knew what to expect and even if things get a little twisted at some point I kept control of the situation that we have a life ahead in that I opened your eyes I wanted to ask you a tiny little favor since you have a very influential power I have this YouTube channel and I would love if you could ask people to subscribe to my channel like this video and leave a comment down below so that will really help my channel and it will really help me create great content for relaxation thank you I will now untie you and we could get married why don't we make a trip to Vegas and just get married right now my car is out there let me untie you it wasn't tight enough was it? I don't know it wasn't I've been studying several techniques on how to tie up without being too aggressive and basically it's by making a lot of knots but not tying up too tight okay awesome all right good to go we are good to go together now let's just have some sleep we can go to Vegas tomorrow you must be very tired I love you so much I love you good night